Yes, anticipation is high on many fronts. Sunday, Spring Stampede live on pay-per-view. We're headed back to the United Center in Chicago. But that level of anticipation grows even more, Tony, when you think that this is going to be the first ever World Championship Wrestling pay-per-view event under the new regime of Vince Russo and Eric Bischoff. And what a card it's going to be. We're going to finally get some answers to a lot of questions about champions in World Championship Wrestling coming up this Sunday. So, you know, we can come out here and we can hype. It's going to be big. It's going to be great. It's going to be very interesting. It's going to finally give us maybe some direction, some light on where we're going in the months to come in World Championship Wrestling. So I really look forward to it, Mike. I think that really is the key, the fact that we will all have that perspective on where WCW is headed for the year 2000 after this Sunday at Spring Stampede. J.C. Ice and Frog, along with uh, Wolfie D, have come to the ring, and of course the opponents, members of the Young Dragons, uh, Jamie San and Yang, where the Young Dragons, in a short span, have, have made their name. Uh, these two men are great cruiserweights in that cruiserweight weight division, but they have made quite a six-man and a tag team combination as well. I think that's really where the, they have made their big splash. It's in the world of the six-man tag teams. They've proven that they can hang in there against some of the top talent in WCW, like Three Count, for example. Go! J.C. Ice with a smack in the face of Jamie Son, and that only took one shot for Jamie Son to get the offense going, momentarily, that is. A duck down over the top, landing on his feet, missing a lariat, pick up, and a great move by Jamie Son. He's got the advantage, and a drop kicking outside goes J.C. Ice. And what we talked about the success of the Dragons in six-man tag team action, this is just your basic four-man tag as we see Jamie Son go airborne, and crashing into J.C. Ice on the arena floor. Meanwhile, in the ring, it's Yang and Frog. That's right. You heard what Yang I said. Frog? Yang and Frog. And a a nice hit shot. That's Yang on the attack. Frog. Oh. That green glow hair and all is down with a drop toe. And now to an armbar. Yeah, I'm not really sure that we need to identify which one Frog is as long as you have color television. And I think most people do now. Well, you never know. Full arm drag and twist. And again. Interesting story behind that one. Into the chest. I never did see color TV until I was 23 years old. 23? Which, was, which was about two weeks ago. Yeah, it was about two years ago, actually. You're right. Amazing story. Tony, there's this new thing. It's called cable. I had cable, but we... At home, we didn't have... We didn't. We had an old black and white, and we had it for years. Huh, enough of that. You need your color TV because there's a lot of colorful things happening in WCW, especially coming up this Sunday at Spring Stampede. Whoopi D getting involved on the outside. Jamie Son turns his back. Yang goes in the ring, cut off by the referee. Cut off by the referee. And Frog up on top. Oh, oh my goodness, what a move that was. The interference on the part of Wolfie D from outside holding on to the leg of Jamie Son allows Frog to go to the top and hit the leg drop. Into the ropes. Back elbow. Just measuring his opponent, stakes him out, and then puts all of his weight jumping into the air right on the midsection. J.C. Ice and Frog sending Jamie Son in, into the midsection they go. Here comes the double team, springboard style off of the near side ropes, and driving the head of Jamie Son face first, down to the mat. Now seeing the interference on the part of Wolfie D reminds us that Kaz, the other member of the Young Dragons, as we see Frog finally go for the cover, and that nonchalance, well, it bites him right back because he's only able to get a two count. Kaz is wrestling over in Japan right now, representing the Young Dragons in the Orient. At first, Jamie San in the center of the ring. And Frog now trying to cover. A little bit deliberate attempt to get that cover, enabling Yang to hit Frog in the ring. You never thought you'd say that, did you? Yang to hit Frog in Yang the ring. Yang to hit Frog. It won't be the last time, I can tell you that. Not only here in this program this week, but in the weeks to come. Here's a drop kick from J.C. Ice. Cover one, two, no. 
Well, it was an early burst of offense on the part of the Dragons, but ever since then, this matchup has been all J.C. Eisenfrog, well, at least to that moment. Oh, up on top, Jamie Son from the middle turnbuckle with the missile drop kick in the midsection of J.C. Ice, makes the tag to Frog, Yang comes in, and here, oh, what a move! He just stopped Frog, just took him right down to the mat, and the knife edge chop has J.C. Ice reeling. Has him sandwiched in the corner with Frog. J.C. Ice, here comes Frog. Oh. He puts his own partner into the face of his own partner. Was that a, a knee lift on the other side? Maybe. Yeah. Yang is up on the oh. turnbuckles now. Pounding away on J.C. Ice. But J.C. Oh. Ice with a short power bomb out of the turnbuckle pads. Yeah, but he's unable to make a cover. That last burst of strength on the part of J.C. Ice is what it took to make the power bomb. Now Frog is going to try and suplex Jamie Son, but he's blocked twice. Jamie Son into the gut, into the rib cage. Actually, that time, Jamie Son. Whoa. Oh no! Oh my goodness! What a move! All the way from the apron to the floor. I don't know if Frog will be able to continue or not. Sunset flip into a power bomb out of the front. You see that? The hub cap brought into play by Wolfie D, but he hit his own partner. Rapid fire blows to the gut from Yang. JC Ice is down. Jamie Son is trying to get back to the ring. I don't know if we're going to see Frog anymore in this match or even the remainder of the month here at WCW. And down goes JC Ice after getting the shot from what looked like a hub cap from Wolfie D. Double team off the top. A splash, and a guillotine leg drop, and a one, two, three. And an exciting win for members of the Young Dragons over Frog and J.C. Ice. Back with more on Worldwide after this timeout. <laughs>